Welcome back guys and this is just going to be a quick video We have a new update coming out tomorrow, March the 15th And that's going to be from 10am to 12pm So without further ado, let's jump into this update content Alright, so first we have new game mode The test for Ichigo slash Ichigo's test Ichigo's test is a more accurate translation So it looks like this game mode is I'm hoping it's not another quiz mode um, it could be like a battle royale type of thing since Ichigo has faced so many opponents maybe the game mode opens and then you need to beat a set amount of um, bosses or enemies in uh, as fast as time as possible that's just a guess though we don't really have any info on that at the moment but the reason I say that is because this game mode has no set time so it's going to open randomly throughout the day they're probably going to release more details on how that works as well so I mean that's not a good thing for me basically because like if that game mode opens when I'm sleeping you know I miss it so um, hopefully it's not that random so I can at least adjust because I want to try it out first anyway new feature the Hogyoku's power or the power of the Hogyoku I'm guessing this is going to be kind of another uh, Zanpakuto thing except it's hopefully we don't get the, another flying orb around us I mean we already have a Zanpakuto we already have a boar following us around and aesthetically wise I kind of wish we could turn that off sometimes but I'm guessing this won't be like that, it's probably just another stat system Hopefully uh, we'll get some additional skills as well The Hongyoku did give um, Orihime and Chad their powers, allegedly at least um, And we also know that the Hongyoku has you know, high speed regeneration and all of that stuff So maybe we'll get some skills with that Simplified game operations, resource recovery, purchase stamina button adjusted, activity panel, accumulated consumption rewards changed to be claimed through a single button. So I'm pretty sure that is referring to red packets. Obviously when the update drops we'll get more information on how all of that works, especially since we have a green bone key rebate coming up, which I'm sure a lot of us are hyped for. Roulette, point store panel adjusted new button added to adjust the redemption quantity so now we can just press the plus button to buy multiple copies at the same time rather than having to buy them one at a time which saves time so I'm really glad they're making some of these adjustments uh, Riatsu limit increased Riatsu can now be upgraded to 13 all the way to 15 so shout out to Aizen because he called that um, I remember it clearly he was saying how we have red character ranks, we have red Zampak Toe. The only logical thing I can see happening next is red Riatsu. And although we don't know the color of the Riatsu yet, it looks like it's probably going to be red Riatsu. So he did call that. Um, at the request of the majority of players, special training, soul swords, and the female character hot spring display have all been optimized so hopefully that's going to make things a lot faster to do and make the game mode a lot smoother this optimization is limited to the display appearance and will not affect your power I mean yeah that's pretty obvious I'm thinking with special training they may add like what um, Saltair and the English versions have I think they have like times 100 special training or something I can't quite remember but if they do add that in that would be a very nice touch um, and after maintenance the following rewards will be handed out as compensation gems, dolls, soul flames etc to apologize for any inconvenience caused compensation will be sent by mail before 12 p.m. 12 a.m. on the day of the update Please give us time as we bring about the new update and make an allowance for any inconvenience caused. 
Alright guys, so I don't want to say too much, I kind of think I've said most of my thoughts as I was going through this. Apologies for my throat, like I, I haven't even been sleeping much lately. But um, if you guys are interested in buying accounts for Bleach Death Awakening and you guys want to start the game but don't want to have to start all over, make sure you head over to my buy accounts channel, I will be updating it with some more accounts very soon. Um, right now all that's there is the true Shikai Ichigo one and uh, more will be added so make sure you, you hit that subscribe button on that channel and um, that aside let me know what you guys think about this upcoming update it is coming on March the 15th to, um, which is tomorrow so um, I'm quite curious actually um, I'd say it's a decent update we're definitely moving in the right direction Apart from the random game time, that's going to mess me up, no doubt. But what I'm really hoping to see is that after we get this new game mode added, that another um, another row of game modes get added. I'm really hoping that happens. So at least we know we can expect more game modes in the future. Anyway, I hope this video wasn't too long. Thanks for watching. Feel free to like, comment, share and subscribe. I'm out.